just recently I received this hammock from one tigress. Um, this is our hammock two uh, with a built-in bug net. So I'm gonna set this up right here and um, we're gonna go ahead and talk about it. I'm gonna show you a couple things uh, that I found out about this hammock um, that I really like and a few things that I think could be adjusted on it. But uh, just stick with me. I'm gonna get this set up and we'll go ahead and talk about it. Okay, so as you can see, I have the hammock set up. Um, a couple things I wanna go over here with you. Um, I wanna show you in particular some of the things that I really like about it, as well as a few things I would probably change about it. Overall, for its price, this is a great hammock for its budget price that they offer. Um, one of the things I do like about it is the bug net that is built in. Um, zippered here, zippers open completely. Um, and so it is a built-in bug net, so that is one feature that I do really like about this. Um, but hey, just stick with me here. I'm going to go ahead and show you a few things on here that I, I really like, as well as a couple things that I think could be changed just a little bit to improve it. But again, like I said, for overall, for its price, for its budget price and everything, this is a really good hammock. Okay, so one of the things about the One Tigress uh, hammock with a bug net built in um, that... I had to change and adjust was my tree straps the ones that come with it are uh, they were very thin not real wide and their options of loops as you can see I have on these was only limited to two or three loops so it didn't offer me that many loops not giving me that many options so unless you're doing your own kind of uh, tree strap system that you uh, make yourself um, I went ahead and just swapped out and I'm using my tree straps from Eno Hammocks, which gives me uh, a, a wider selection, more loops to work with, depending on my distance between trees. Um, the other thing about this hammock is it's built in bug net, as I talked about. Um, you have your zipper system. It is, it is built right in, zippers you right in, and um, I do like that about this hammock that it has it it's built right in um, one of the things I would probably change about this hammock um, it's a windy day out here today but one of these things I would change about this hammock regarding uh, its bug net is this ridge line um, they have it so you have two ridge lines so that when you're inside it spreads apart spreads open now, the only thing that I would probably change is if there was a way, say, see these loops here? Uh, if this was made out of a heavier duty material and it had like a pocket in here on both sides, allowing me to insert like a short collapsible uh, tent pole, thereby helping to spread that out a little bit more. Um, for the most part, though, once I'm inside it, this does spread wide open um, somewhat. But I think if it had those poles just to kind of pull this open and hold it there, that could be a, a good benefit uh, to the hammock. Um, I can tell you um, that I had slept out in this just recently during overnight. Um, it is a very comfortable hammock. Um, it does uh, pack up nice and light. This is um, lighter, actually, than some of my other hammocks that I have. Um, but like I said, overall, for its price, um, if you're looking for a good hammock with a built-in bug net uh, at a low budget, uh, this is going to be a good hammock to go with. Um, so there you go. Um, just a few things I wanted to talk about regarding the hammock. One last thing I will touch on is uh, this part of the hammock here. Okay, so when you get this hammock, most hammocks when you buy them, your carabiner, your hookup system is already set to go. It's tied off. You don't need to do anything. Uh, with this system, uh, they send it to you, so you actually have to go ahead and uh, get this tied off yourself and, and uh, get that get that rigged up for yourself um, 
So that is one thing that does come when it comes to you. The hammock comes to you, you do need to do. So there you go, the one tiger's hammock with a built-in bug net. Um, there's my thoughts that you got on that. Like I said, built-in bug net uh, is a great feature for this. I love how that they, they have that. Like I said, the only other thing that I would probably change on here is this. You gotta have that, as I said, to spread open some. But this is a good hammock. Um, I'm gonna finish getting set up here with everything that I need, and uh, it's gonna be a chilly night. But I'm gonna go ahead and try to challenge myself here and spend the night right here by this beautiful lake. So until next time, guys, get outside.